You guys, you never stop talking. Oh, man. <laughs> Edible. Oh, that is nasty. Cottonwoods are bad this year. What's going on, everybody? It's Mike with Sunny Slope Homestead. Uh, we actually moved our goats. For those who are not familiar or new to the channel, we actually had to move our goats from our permanent enclosure, our, our main enclosure, out because they were bullying and beating up the two baby goats that we have. And they're not quite babies anymore. So we started using these guys for brush control. And this is what they've been clearing out. They have cleared out this whole area that was absolutely completely thick. Yeah, that's a rooster in there. Don't ask. Guys, what is all this ruckus up here? Ruckus. A lot of popping. You got, ooh, God, it got me. It got me, guys. What's up, man? You guys enjoying it? You guys have done a really good job on getting all this cleared out. And Boots, I have a special treat for you, bud. Guess what? Since you are such a good goat, and you're docile, and you're the nicest one of the bunch, you have earned your right back into the main enclosure. Yes. I know. Are, are you excited or what, man? Yeah. Yeah. This is a big day. You get to go back into the enclosure, which has grown, grown because these little guys, they can't keep up with it. I know, right? You're excited. He's excited. Woo! Look how big they've gotten. Bonnie's horn is growing back greater than ever, and Clyde is walking. I know. You guys, you hear how ecstatic he is? He's so happy he's going to get to go back into his enclosure. Woo, it's hotter than the dickens out, y'all. Woo. My favorite saying is hotter than fish grease, and it's not even not the hottest part of the day yet. Boots is gonna come live with you guys. Are you excited? Boots is kind of a nice one. We'll see how he goes. And we'll slowly introduce you guys. Well, you guys want food, don't you? You want food. Yeah. Hey, sweetie. Look at that horn. It has grown back nice and strong. Wow, you guys want some food, huh? Yeah, look, grass everywhere, weeds everywhere. You don't think your goats do much, but they really do. Because this was never like this. Look how overgrown this is because I've had those two baby goats in here. And I haven't had the other goats. And you can see how fast this is all grown up and just weeded over that is crazy look at this that's absolutely nuts come on all right let's get your little your little feed bucket thing set up here Man. all right ready You can tell that horn is really growing back nice. She don't know what to think about that camera. But look at that. It's coming in quite nice, I would say. Hi, sweetie. And for you, Mr. Boots. Das Boot. Das Boot. Yeah, Das Boot. Oh man, that thing's annoying. I'm trying to do this without getting zapped. There. Boots, you're gonna you're gonna move into the other enclosure today. We're gonna wait on my son to give me a hand with that. Because I don't want the other goats to get out. Because it'll be a bear to get them back in. But man, I am just impressed with what they did back here. But to give you an idea of what that back there used to look like, this is pretty much the ground cover from here on back. They go from this. To that and fairly fairly quick too so what we're gonna do I'm gonna wait for the Sun to get home and uh, my nephew is gonna be here too 
and uh, he's city boy. So we'll see how he uh, helps us get this goat in the goat enclosure. Be right back. Well, how are you gonna go about this? What's the plan? Grab his horns. You're gonna just grab its horns. So you gotta get in there, grab its horns, huh? What's that? It didn't really work. No? He don't trust you. He knows something's up. Maybe you need to go get a bag of Cheez-Its. what? Cheez-Its. Or chips, some kind of snack. Sure. Mom, the animal crackers. Yeah. Oh, you got him! You got him! <laughs> All right, I'll... I'll lift the fence down. I'll bring the fence down. <laughs> there, bud. Right here. Oh. Just walk across this area. Don't want him getting tangled up, though. Oh. All right. Get this fence back up. He got him over. I Woo. Can't believe that. You might be able to get him in the pin now, right? Yeah. Oh, bud. Oh, bud, you're all right. You okay? You might be able to get him in that pin, just Hopefully. walking him up there with some food. You think so? No, he's gonna run away. He's gonna run away. When I just did him, I took him and gave him his feet from the, the leaf and grabbed his horn. <laughs> I trusted you! He's a heavy goat, huh? He's also fighting back. Yep. Well. So we'll open the gate. <laughs> Look at you breaking a sweat. You never seen one of those? Like this? Yep. Boom! Give him some feed. Give him a scoop. Give him a scoop. Bam. Look, these guys are like, what did you just do? What did you just do? Mother of God. What did you put in here? Why would you do that to us? Um, yeah, he looks, uh, he's gonna look a little depressed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that. He's already finding the good stuff. Let's we'll see, he's probably gonna go back to uh, the fence and see what's going on. Hey, you guys will be next if you just get your act right. You won't. <coughs> Oh yeah. You're real happy now. Can I get this all to myself? <laughs> yep. Be a plump boy. Yeah. Get in my belly. Hey, uh, you want? You can touch that fence if you want. I'm, I'm, I'm good. You're good. I, the fence is on. I became here, and he's like, just like over the fence with his shirt touching it and everything. And the fence is on. I'm um, plugging. He's like. I couldn't hear the beeping either. No beeping. <laughs> you hear that little snappy snap. Yeah, little snappy. You know, you know not to hit that fence. <laughs> but I didn't right. hear it, so I thought it was okay. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, appreciate you watching. We'll see you on the next episode. Yeah.